Hi, now I'm going to explain the project machine learning approach for forecasting urban pollution. This project is based on the data mining domain. The main objective of the project is to predict fine particulate matter given a combination of weather condition. In this project based on the data set, we are going to predict the next day uh, pollution details. In this project, we are using the collaborative algorithm to find the prediction data. The software requirement for this project is firstly the Eclipse. Eclipse is an IDE means integrated development environment. With the help of Eclipse, we can able to develop the web applications as well as Java applications. It will give the standard directory structure to develop the applications. And secondly, we are using the Tomcat as the server. And with the help of Tomcat server, we can able to deploy our applications. Then we are using MySQL as the database and SQL log is the interface for the MySQL. In this project, we are using the web services means from server to the client, we are interacting. So here in this project, uh, there are two applications are there. One is the admin server side means uh, the admin will be there. Then the user part here, user will be there. This is the user part. This is the admin part. This is win one server. This is the IP address of the admin. And this is the IP address of the user. Both are running in the separate servers. This project is built based on the uh, MVC architecture. MVC means the model view controller. It is a software design pattern to develop the web application. Model means the lowest level of pattern which is responsible for maintaining the data. View is responsible for displaying all the portion of the data to the user. And controller is a software code that controls the interaction between the model and the view. Because of this model view controller, we can able to host this application in the cloud also. In the real time also we can able to use this application. From server to server we are communicating. This is the admin and this is the user. Both are deployed in the separate systems. Both applications are deployed in the sub separate systems. So login with the admin. This is admin login page means admin home page now after after successful uh, login admin can able to view the admin home page then the admin is going to upload the data set means the previous data set of the pollution details of the respective city or respective place so now i'm going to upload the details of uh, BTM it is done area a uh, Bangalore we can able to view the data set it is in the form of the excel sheet uh, now this is the data set what we are going to upload means here value v1 means the nitric oxide now this is the excel sheet we are going to upload to the uh, database firstly the nitric oxide and the date and the time and the concentration in the environment and this is the previous one this is the present concentration and this is the previous one then the nitrogen dioxide these are the parameters we are taking uh, nitric oxide nitrogen dioxide uh, oxides of nitrogen sulfur dioxide carbon monoxide mm -hmm. ozone then pm uh, 2.5 relative humidity wind speed as well as wind direction so the same manner we are taking the present value in the excel sheet So I am selecting the BTM 
and choosing the Bangalore BTM areas uh, pollution data then I am going to upload to the database it is uploaded to the server database we, here we are seeing the this is the user user client side database and this is the server side database here now it is uh, uploaded to the database now this is the area location means uh, location code and these are the values v1 v2 v3 means uh, the respective nitric oxide nitrogen oxide like that then the admin can able to upload one more data set of the different uh, place this is the second place upload then it is uploaded in the server database now this is the location code and this is the these are the respective values based on this the user will going to predict the uh, tomorrow's pollution data with the help of collaborative algorithm we are finding the prediction value now this is the client side application client has to sign up himself user registered successfully now we can able to log in to his account now this is the home page of the user he can able to choose the location and he can able to view the present data now he can able to see the present data of uh, present value of nitric oxide nitrogen dioxide oxides of nitrogen sulfur dioxide carbon monoxide ozone pm 2.5 uh, relative humidity wind speed and wind direction based on this is going to predict tomorrow's value now the values has been changed the net to the nitric oxide uh, is 3.0 like this this is the prediction value based on the collaborative algorithm we are finding the prediction value this is the machine learning approach to forecasting urban pollution thank you